In 2015, the Knorr Bremsa Corporation recognized New York Air Brake for technological excellence. In 1890, the Eames Vacuum Brake Company began making brakes for trains in Watertown, New York. Shortly thereafter, this regional business expanded its capabilities and product offering to become New York Air Brake. In 1991, New York Air Brake joined the family of Knorr Bremsa Companies, led by Heinz Hermann Thiele. Building on Mr. Tila's commitment to technological excellence and other key corporate values, Knorr Bremsa is the world's leading manufacturer of braking systems for rail and commercial vehicles. If you went back historically, New York Air Brake um, always had technological excellence, entrepreneurship, reliability, passion, I think is one of the areas that we excel in. Our approach to business meshed very well with what Knorr's, uh, Knorr's approach to business was. We are absolutely a center of excellence for heavy haul. In fact, it's one of the, I'd say, the, the badges of honor that we wear very proudly. We are COC for AAR heavy haul. So if you go around the globe, the New York Air Brake brand is what Knorr Brem sells into heavy haul markets globally. Today, New York Air Brake is recognized worldwide as the center of excellence for heavy haul freight railroad control systems, with customers across the United States and reaching clear across the globe. Where New York Air Brake equipped freight trains carry ore, coal, lumber, cars, trucks, and countless other commodities critical to consumers, businesses, and whole economies worldwide. In fact, New York Air Brake train control components and systems are deployed throughout each train. One of the strongest common denominators across the technologies we provide the ability to anticipate and respond to customer problems with an absolute dedication to technological excellence. So a few years ago, New York Air Brake introduced a, a slogan that was called Engineer Doubt Performer, or E2O, right? The question became, who do we want to be? What claim do we want to stake in the market? How do we differentiate ourselves from everybody else that's got something to sell? Any company, no matter who you are, it all comes down to people and it all comes down to the way that they approach problems. You know, one of the magic moments for me in, in, in having received this award is when you look at the breadth of participation in, in the company and the different departments that, that brought brake cylinder maintaining to a feature inside of the DB60. It was amazing how many people needed to be part of that and it was natural. This is the way we operate. So it had the cross-functional capability quality manufacturing, engineering, to make sure that we were, we were bringing all of those different disciplines to the product. So at the end, we were successful, not because we're just good at engineering, we were successful because we were good at identifying and fixing problems with technology that, that is difficult for, for most to bring. New York Air Brake does this especially well. Yeah, so we submitted the, the application, and guess what? We won.